Welcome, welcome, welcome. Court here. That's going to be sad. I always feel like Steve here. Like Blue's Clues. People are snagging my content and putting it on their YouTube. So I'm just putting my face in it for this week. For my newbies, I'm Courtney. This is what I look like. Okay. Um, I've had better days. But um, this is going to be for Sagittarius week 3 of June. Okay. So let's see what we're looking at. You might be traveling. My daughter just texted me. She's traveling to Texas in October. So... And I just saw it. Or you could be dealing with an Austin because that's where she's going. So, any hoozy, this is going to be for Sagittarius week three. Got the Queen of Pence. Strength card, the Magician, Seven of Swords, Knight of Swords, and the World. Queen of Pence and Strength, the Magician and the Seven of Swords, that's never the greatest energy, and the Knight of Swords with the World. My back is rocking all of a sudden. <sighs> booty, 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 rocking everywhere. Okay. Taurus energy. Either coming in in Taurus, Sag, or Leo energy. Could be some air here too. You're not going to like the messages coming in this week. You're holding yourself back. But I think that might be a good thing. I'm not going to lie to you. There was there's some sneaky shit going down here. Someone just, the, the communication is, is lies. Trickery. Like, wrap that shit up. You might be in a playful mood this week, so don't engage. Because there was something toxic. Someone's just getting out of something toxic or something that wasn't good. It was unhealthy because strength is here, right? So you have a feminine energy that needs to hold back this week. And it could be just communication. Someone could be coming at you because something's over and they don't like that something's over. So I don't know what type of method they're going to use. Damn. See the magician is, is that devil. It could be sexual. And I kind of feel like you're a little horny, so be careful. I would definitely hold back and I'm just giving you my advice, like wrap it up, like actually physically if you're going to engage, make sure you wrap it up and be safe, but I'm telling you, I, I wouldn't because the the energy of the devil is still lingering, it's it's toxic, it's unhealthy, you don't, you don't want to swap energy like that, troops, that's, that's a big message for you guys. Yeah, someone's going to try to be in and come in and be really seductive here. Could be dealing with a fire sign. That's going to hit you up. Yeah, someone is not happy they didn't put enough work into something. I mean, that it's, it's so strong, you holding yourself back like this. And I'm telling you, it's like, it's a necessity. Knight of Wands. This is somebody that is, that's like, watch your back. You could be getting a message like, watch your back. I don't like that. 
Yeah, look at the death card. Someone's pissed that something's over. Like, not happy, not having it, jealous. I mean, it's not... Hold yourself back, ladies. Something's over. Somebody didn't put enough work into something. It was toxic. It was unhealthy. It's like they act one way and then they, they hit you up another way. Someone misses being intimate with you. So you, so you had a connection where it could be very um, feisty and then very, like, passionate. Well, those could both be the same thing. Like, meaning, like, you can be tied up and you would trust somebody and let them whip you. Just an example. And then others of you, it was, like, making love. You have both sides. You've had both sides of somebody. <coughs> Sag. Something's over. Let it be over. You have an energy watching you. I, I would continue to hold back. Yeah, four of wands. This is somebody who had an opportunity to have a nice solid situation with you, but they chose otherwise. They could have chose wrong with justice being here. They they had a chance to create balance, to find balance, to come into harmony and, you know. Let something be over. Someone's literally hitting you up out of jealousy or vice versa. Go put your time and effort into something else. It's it's so clear. You got the wolf. There's earth energy. Guardian of family and tribe. Activism and rituals. The wolf's mission is to uphold the well-being and longevity of its pack. Healthy wolf energy expresses itself through activism, mentorship, humanitarian efforts, or teaching religious or political, political studies. The wolf gets into trouble when it assumes every member of the tribe must follow suit. This includes children walking in their parents' footsteps. Although it will surely be uncomfortable at first, practicing tolerance helps balance without agitating the wolf energy. Contemplate the following. Embrace all, include none. Damn. Like I, I told you. Just saying no. When you're in balance, you're reliable, democratic, and fearless. When you're out of balance, you're judgmental and dominating. To bring into back practice, to bring into balance, let go. <laughs> uh, yeah, let it go. I'm telling you. Let it go. Whatever this is, let it go. It's, it's unhealthy. You don't want that energy. Wrap it up. This person had an opportunity to put the effort in, to show more. They didn't. Could have been something comic, but they had an opportunity to ground something, and they, they didn't. It was unbalanced. It's over. Let it go. There could be somebody else, but who cares? I know It's that energy of um, misery loves company. Let them be together if that's the case, or vice versa. It, it's tricky. It's unhealthy. I'm telling you, it's... Yeah, I'm, you're going to get a message of, like more of I want this I want it in my arms no I, I can't stress it enough and you're resisting so why you're resisting right now because you're you're more of a leader so be careful because you don't want your kids to fall in your footsteps so there's a big lesson here too of conditioning for those who have children or you're just a mentor the wolf gets into trouble when it assumes every member in the tribe must follow suit. Not everybody needs to follow suit. So there's some anger issues here. This is somebody who wants wanted somebody to fall into their trap. But be careful because this includes children walking in their parents' footsteps. Yeah, it's going to be uncomfortable. You're going to have to tolerate what's going down, but let it go. Embrace all and include none. To bring something into balance, let it go. Stop engaging. 
no matter if you're a karmic, not a karmic, a soulmate, it doesn't matter. Whoever this message is for, stop. Wrap it up. Let it go. It's, it's so clear. I love you guys. I hope you have a kick-ass week. Bye.